Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about removing the shortcut arrow icon on your Windows device. So you can see the little arrow in the bottom left corner of the shortcut. If you want to remove that, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it, and we're going to start by opening up the star menu. Type in regedit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match to go back to registry editor. You want to right click on that and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. Now before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it so if anything went wrong in the future, you could easily restore it back. In order to create the backup, it's very simple. Just go ahead and left click on the file tab. Select export. For file name, I would suggest naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Save into convenient location on your computer, and then export range should be selected to all. And then once you're done with that, just select save. And if you ever need to import it back in, you just put select file and then import. And navigate to the file location, so again, pretty straightforward. And now we're ready to begin, so expand the HK local machine folder, so go ahead and double click on that. Do the same thing for the software folder. Same thing for Microsoft. And now do the same thing for Windows. So scroll down a little bit. Expand that. Locate current version. Expand that. And now there should be an Explorer folder under here. Go ahead and just left click on that. Now you want to right click on the Explorer folder. Select New. Then select Key and you want to name this key shell icons so we're going to rename it shell icons so s h e l l and then a space i c o n s hit enter on your keyboard if you need to take pause and take note of the file path as well i think it's a good time to mention this you can see the path that we've gone under so far at the top of the screen here each backslash is a different folder we've gone under and we just created this shell icons folder at the end so now that you've done that, on the right side, you want to right click inside of a blank area, select new, then select string value, type in 29, so the number 29, hit enter on your keyboard. Now I'm going to have a value in the description of my video, I want you guys to copy it, and then double click on this string value, this 29 value we just created here, and paste it in. So again, it's going to be in my description here, you can see it on the screen as well. Select OK. And once you're done with that, you can just go ahead and close out of the registry editor. Restart your computer and the arrow icons should be gone. If you ever want to revert what we did, you can just delete the shell icon folder we created. And then that's pretty much it. So restart your system. So we're going to go ahead and restart our computer here just to provide a demonstration. And there you go guys, you can see the Firefox shortcut no longer has an arrow key. So pretty straightforward tutorial guys, I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.